Hey guys, it's Juan with Tinker Garage and thanks for tuning in. And today we are going to build a stand for my metal target. That is my metal target right there. It's 400 uh, AR still. I think that's what my brother-in-law said. It, as you can see, it's a pretty thick bastard. Um, it has two holes. It's extremely heavy. I'm going to build a 2x4 type holding stand out of these three 2x4. Um, so yeah, tune in. Come join me. Hopefully I don't screw anything up and let's get after it. All right, guys, as you can see, we're done building our shooting stand. Like I said, this is, let's get over here, close to three quarter inch. I think it's AR 400, AR 400 steel plate. It's the plate they use at a rock quarry um, for like liners for rocks. So I know it can take a lot of wear. I've already shot at it before. Um, looks like these are 7.62 by 39 rounds. The AK round, pretty much. Um, see, like those headshots. I mean, that's without my scope being um, actually zeroed in too. So, but yeah, so I used uh, three two by fours that are eight foot long. Um, I did the, let's see, let's see if I can show you this. Hold on. Sorry for the all blur, which I'm gonna have to flip it over so I can show you guys. Sorry, I'm being a booger face because it's really cold right now. So even though it's Arizona, I know. All right guys, this is the target. You can see where looks like some of these were 7.62 by 39, some were 556, five, the green tip, which made some huge holes but did not penetrate. You can see the back of this. I'll aim it a little low. That is hard still. Yeah. Yeah, this is definitely hardened steel. You say what it was, AR-400 AR steel? Plate steel? So yeah. Hell yeah, guys. <laughs> yeah, so that's how I built the stand. So, <clears throat> there you go. Like the two by fours were like three bucks. I already had the box of screws. So, um, only thing that cost me were the bolts and nuts and washers, which are three quarter inch, kind of like all thread, like um, carriage bolts. That's what I think, I believe I got. Um, no, they're not, they're not carriage bolts, but they're just bolts anyways, but those are like three bucks each. So everything was under like 20 bucks, so can't beat that. And if it gets destroyed, I can always build another one. So as much as I can build it off this frame, I can just unscrew them, put the new board in, re screw everything back together. So yeah, so if you guys have any questions about it, leave them in the comments below. Um, I'll try to build, I'm going to try to build more builds like this. Um, but yeah, so that's just my quick tip on a shooting stand. Um, yeah, see, that's the brace, so this doesn't teeter-totter. But, yeah, but again, that's um, my take on a home build on a uh, shooting stand when you're shooting a metal target. All right, awesome. Thanks again. Remember, leave a comment if you want to. Um, don't forget to subscribe, and I'll see you guys soon.